What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Today's video is going to be interesting because this is something we should have done a long time ago and that is a proper self-defense test with my all-time favorite rifle, the Henry Lever Action 4570 T-Rex rifle. Now we've had this gun on the channel quite a bit and a lot of you guys are just as in love with this thing as I am. It is an absolutely awesome gun and this should be the ultimate test to really see what this thing is capable of because for this video we've got a special target. The Ballistic Dummy Lab Human Head. So we've done several videos on these Ballistic Dummy Lab products and they've gotta be my favorite targets to shoot. They're just so realistic, so much fun. It's obviously not real or graphic in any way, but it's the closest thing you can get to really test your gun and see what it would do in a self-defense situation. So this ought to be good. By the way, if you go to BallisticDummyLab.com, use the coupon code ONESHOTTV and save 10% on your order. They also have a YouTube channel. I'll put the links to all that stuff down in the description box below they're a great company and they make really cool stuff so go check them out so there's obviously a million things to consider when you're choosing a self-defense gun but today we're just seeing how powerful the 4570 is and the first thing I want to do is compare a few different rounds on watermelons and the winner will be the one that we shoot the head with because I have a feeling that head's only gonna take one round and first up we have the 325 grain Hornady FTX Well, <laughs> I don't think I've ever shot a watermelon that close with a 4570. That was ridiculous. <laughs> Next up, we have the 300 grain Precision One Hollow Point. After this, we got a big one that we've never shot before. So let's see what the Precision One does. It's gonna be hard to beat that Hornady. Whoa. I think that just beat it. <laughs> so I don't know what it looked like to you guys, but to me that precision one looked way more dramatic. And of course, I saved the biggest one for last. I actually got these just for this video, and this is a 460 grain plus P hard cast grizzly bullet. And look at that monster. This one's gonna hurt. You guys have been harassing me forever to get some more powerful 4570 ammo, so let's see what it does. This is not a hollow point, so it might not explode our watermelon as good, but I'm hoping it does, because I really want to use this for the head. This one's gonna recoil. Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! Well, it definitely exploded our watermelon, but I don't know how dramatic it was because I was looking up at the sky when it hit. <laughs> Good creep. So typically what I would do with these videos in the past is just sit the head on a table and shoot it that way and it would fall over or roll off the table. But this time I went ahead and fastened it down. So you can see we've got our head screwed into that piece of wood and then I screwed that wood directly into the table. It's not like we don't already have a thousand bullet holes on the table anyway and I'm hoping that it will keep it in place and give us a better idea of what the 4570 actually does to this thing. All right, so I know it's not a hollow point, but I have to use the 460 grain plus P Grizzly. It's the most powerful round we got, and we might only get one shot on this thing. I've got a couple slow-mo cameras and a high frame rate camera with a remote that I'm gonna try to hit right after I shoot and really capture this in slow motion. Here we go. <laughs> Well, I think that did the trick.
So I've got a high frame rate camera over here and I can never seem to hit the remote in time, but we still got a couple good slow-mo shots. And here is what's left. <laughs> Just knocked the top half of his block off. That is insane. And then obviously we've got a little mess over here. Pieces of the skull all the way back here and some more down here. This is probably the biggest chunk, I would say. And there's a piece of our condom. And I hope you guys can see the mess that it made. It's all over the leaves, my tripods, my cameras, obviously the table. <laughs> and I'll give you one more look at the damage that it did. That is pretty incredible. Well, it looks like my prediction was correct. 145.70 is all it took to completely decimate that thing. And I'm sure we all kind of expected that. I would say that was more impressive than even the 500 Magnum that I shot last summer. That was freaking amazing. All right, guys, there you have it. Another Ballistic Dummy Lab human head down and probably the most impressive so far. Again, if you want to pick up some of this stuff for yourself, visit their website and use the discount code at OneShot TV. Also, check out their YouTube channel. I will put links to all that stuff down in the description box below. I want to thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Again, this is not real or graphic in any way. 100% fake, 100% fun, scientific experimentation. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please let me know down in the comments below. As always, hit that like button for me, guys. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you next time.